Hey guys, today we're here with the detailing pod. This is our new detailing pod. We've done a lot to make this machine as good as possible. From the design aspects of it, to make it appealing to the customer, to our transparent container. It's a five gallon storage container that'll store your EcoSmart product. That'll also enable you to see how much product's left, as well as tell your consumers that we're using a green product. Now the product itself is not only green, the color of it is also green. So you get the benefit of both worlds. You get a product that delivers a complete detail without the use of water. It is sprayed on the vehicle. The product will lift and emulsify the dirt away from the surface. And as it lifts and emulsifies the dirt away, you will wipe it off in one direction with a towel, allow it to haze and buff it off. We'll get into that later. I wanted to basically cover the features of our new DP is what it's called. It's called the Eco Detailing Pod. And we call it a pod because it does have a very pod-like design. Now, what we've done with the pod is a variety of different things. Is besides having the five-gallon container, we've made a very easy to remove top. Now, inside the top, you can store all of your product. We didn't want to use a plastic top. We wanted something with a handle so it's easy for you to um, both loosen it and tighten it. Now, inside the unit, we've accommodated it with a different type of suction hose and we've put a filter on the end of it. Now it's a long life filter, it lasts about five years. That's the filter on any type of contamination you might have inside of your five gallons. Sometimes you might not have distilled water available. You might need to use um, water that you get somewhere else or might accidentally drop something in there. You don't want your pump sucking that up. Now this also enables you to put this into a different five gallon container and clean out your DP when you're done. Now all you gotta do to get it done is just put it back in there, make sure that it's inside the chemical and you're good to go. Now when you're tightening your lid, you don't have to over tighten it, it's got two seals, one on the inside and one on the outside to guarantee the product doesn't leak out. You just want to leave it at the 12 o'clock just like that. Now as I flip around the DT auto, you're going to see a lot of different cool things on this unit. I'll pull this cord around so you guys can see what's going on. Now on the unit itself, you have an on and off switch that's going to turn the unit on and off. Now inside this unit, it has a brain similar to a computer. It'll have two batteries, they are laptop batteries that will control the charge of it as well as it has a... Um, basically a little brain inside of it like a laptop that'll make sure you don't overcharge the batteries. Now as you flip around the unit you'll notice it's got some very heavy duty wheels. They are a rubber coated heavy duty wheel so it'll take a lot of years both of, uh, of sun damage and moving it around. We realize that a lot of professionals are going to be putting a lot of miles on this unit so we want to make sure you got a good quality wheel there. Uh, we've put bearings inside the wheels as well which a lot of companies haven't done. Now when designing our detailing pod we made all of our fittings the highest quality easy quick release fittings. So you can change your hose or add an extendable hose if you wish to do so. The pump inside the unit is an 80 PSI pump. Now this is a low pressure system that enables you to not waste a lot of product. And we've stepped it up from our traditional unit, which was a 50 PSI unit, to an 80 PSI unit that we get more pressure and also puts a lot less wear and tear on the pump itself. Now the quick release features are on one side of the hose as well as on the second side where it connects to the gun. Now traditionally a lot of the guns have the quick release on the bottom. Uh, it makes the gun a little bit flimsy and it doesn't give you the type of reaction time that we wanted with our unit. We wanted to make something really good. So our sprayer unit is a PA. It's an Italian made sprayer gun. They make some of the best sprayers on the market today. And it also has the safety so you don't accidentally spray yourself. And you have a quick release on the bottom and on the top. Your top quick release enables you to gently and easily release the tip. You got a super fine tip on this for spraying on the outside of the vehicle. If you need an extendable pole, a lot of companies will sell you an extendable pole. Um, the price range is anywhere from $35 to $85. Bucks. On our unit here, we actually include it. Now it's a stainless steel extendable and you have your same sprayer tip with the quick release on here. So if you're doing cars that are a little bit taller or if you're working on engine compartments that are hard to reach or doing wheels where you like to reach inside the wheel, you can go ahead and attach your sprayer just like you did with the simple one, fast and easy, and swivel it depending on where you need to use it. Now my favorite part about this, it's a stainless steel, um, is not only the quick release side of it, but the fact that it doesn't drip. We've constructed this unit to where it won't drip when, you, you, when you're done spraying. A lot of them um, will start dripping. Ours will only drip when you do the quick release. So as you quick release it, you might want to make sure that it's nowhere where it could drip. Put that guy away. Now we've also fitted our DP with a storage unit. Now the storage unit is great if you're going to be hooking products on there. So if you've got any type of products you need to hook on there or your towels. We also use the storage unit to store our power cord. 
Now the power cord of this unit is something a lot of you might be familiar with. The power cord of this unit will have the same attachment that a lot of your computers at home have. That enables you in case you ever lose your power attachment, um, you can fit it with anything you have at home. We've put a hook and loop really bright um, cord collector in there for you. That way if you accidentally leave it somewhere, it's going to be easy for you to spot. We really recommend you guys keep it inside your tray. Now inside the tray you'll also notice once again the sprayer sprayers how you will be actually spraying the product on it. Now put it down just for a few seconds. I want to show you a few more features on the unit. Now you might also notice that you have a, um, a clear tube right here. Now a lot of times these are black and you can't see if something's stuck inside of them. We've went ahead and fitted ours with a 100% transparent um, coiling tube. That enables you to get a lot of reach. So if you're working around a vehicle, just give me a quick idea. Anywhere between 15 and 25 feet of extendable cord so you can work around the vehicle. Now if you're working uh, up on the down on bottom or up on top, the cord's going to really stretch for you. And we've made it out of a um, clear rubber so in case it does hit against the surface of the car, it not only won't mark but it won't in any way scratch the surface as well which is great for that. Now just keep in mind that it is very long so if you are doing a shorter distance you might want to just hook it onto the front. Now in the front you have a small hook that not only can control your cord but you can also hook towels and stuff onto which is great. Now, as I flip in front of the unit, I want to show you guys something uh, before I turn it around. It'll also show you how much product is left. Now, when you turn on your DP unit, you're going to notice it doesn't have a lot of noise. That's about all the noise that will come out of your DP. And I want you guys to have an idea. Make sure that your siphoning hose is inside your product. Let's make sure our siphoning hose is in there. Sometimes when you go to clean it, you won't put the hose right in there. And it'll let you know that it's not in because it won't siphon the product out. Just use a towel there to wipe myself. Now I like to release my nozzle and get the most amount of pressure out of it as I filter into the line. So if you notice right here on the line, I want you guys to pay attention to the line as the product is picked up all inside the cord. It'll wind up all throughout the cord, all of the front, and you'll notice the product starts coming out. Now you don't need to be wasteful with this product. It's an environmentally friendly product. So you want to go ahead and put your tip on there just to get a light mist. So if you guys will notice, it'll give you a super fine, very gentle mist that you're actually just misting onto the vehicle. And I'll show you guys how that works in a few minutes. What we want to do is just gently mist the product onto the surface. Now when you're done with it, what we like to do, we always recommend customers turn off your unit and take all the pressure out of the line. If you notice. A nice PSI will stay in the line. That'll prevent the unit from accumulating pressure and eventually leaking. These units do not leak in any way. They're new and all of them are quality assured tested before they leave. We offer a white glove service on all of them. That means before the unit actually ships out, it's tested to make sure that there's no leaks, everything's fully functioning on the unit itself. Now there's also a full color catalog that comes with the unit that explains every aspect of the unit. So once again, as I flip it over, I've uh, pointed out the extendable cord for you guys. When you're plugging it in, it's very easy to do. You want to leave the unit in the off mode. You'll notice that the unit is off because if you notice back here, you have a little orange light. As you turn on your unit, you'll notice the pump will turn off automatically when there's enough pressure in the line, and the light will tell you that the unit is functioning properly. You never want to charge it with the light on. You want to go ahead and turn off your unit, grab your extendable cord, simply pull it right out just like that. Grab the plug cord and just plug it into the side of your unit like you would any type of computer, and then plug this side into your electrical socket. Now, you really don't need to recharge this unit. It's got a 20 hour functioning life. That means you can actually run the batteries for 20 hours straight before they will actually uh, need recharging. Now, in our university here, we've had these units in testing for eight months. In eight months, we've never had to recharge the battery. So you're gonna get a lot out of that battery, which is both good for the environment because you're not wasting a lot of electricity and good for you. Now with the detailing pod, what actually goes inside the detailing pod, close that up for you. Always make sure you put your cord away guys. Grab your cover, close up. What will go inside the front, I'm going to flip this guy around for you guys. Now once again, you'll know how much product you have left because of the transparent pod. It's an HDPE recycled material. Um, it's also great because it's very durable. It's over a quarter inch thick. So uh, if in any case somebody ends up hitting it or you end up dropping it out of the trunk of your car, um, the construction of it is very strong. Now we've also fitted the side of it with a heavy duty HDPE black pipe. The black pipe here will enable you to keep your normal tip as well as your extendable tip. Sometimes you're working, you want to make sure that the tip fits nicely in there. Now at the bottom of it we have a grommet so in case it drips you don't get any drips outside of it. Makes it easy for you to store the gun. 
Now inside the unit, all you'll have to do is open it. What will go inside the unit is your waterless product. In this case, we're going with EcoSmart Concentrated. A 16 ounce bottle of EcoSmart is all it takes for this entire unit. Now you'll put one 16 ounce of EcoSmart, the rest five gallons of water. Now keep in mind the properly diluted EcoSmart RU, you can easily detail up to four full size vehicles with a single 16 ounce bottle. So if you figure that eight 16 ounce bottles fit in a gallon, and that you're fitting five gallons into this unit, you get a whole lot of cars you can detail with that, so don't be wasteful. Now, if you're doing extremely dirty cars, uh, you might want to put two 16 ounces of EcoSmart into your unit and the rest distilled water. Now, you can leave your unit with the product inside. It's no problem at all. Um, I always recommend that when you've done with a unit every week or so, just rinse it out with clean distilled water to make sure that everything's functioning right. Now, with an 80 PSI pump, two laptop batteries inside of it, the computer brain to regulate the battery charge, a very sturdy construction, the heavy duty wheels on the sides. We also have the easy handle here. It makes it a great unit for detailing. Now, this is not simply a waterless unit. It is a full detailing unit. It enables you to go around and detail cars with it and also attracts a lot of attention. You get a lot of customers that will see you working with this unit. It is uh, cordless. It is environmentally friendly. The product that goes inside of it is environmentally friendly and that's extremely exciting for us. We're going to put out a unit that you're really going to enjoy. So we hope when you take home your DP unit, it's a great unit. We look forward to feedback from you. If you guys are on Facebook or you follow us at all online, we greatly look forward to any feedback on the unit. We're constantly improving on it. We want to make a great unit that you guys will really enjoy. So thanks for tuning in. We're going to have a lot more of these videos, so we hope you enjoy it. Thanks for coming.